Vienna, Austria, 1846. A time of relative peace and prosperity. The Enlightenment is long past, but its effects have not been felt everywhere. At Vienna's General Hospital, the practice of the healing arts is just beginning to come out of a dark age of ignorance and superstition. Scurvy, jaundice, rickets, and gangrene are common, as are epidemics. Decades before the time of Louis Pasteur, the most rudimentary understanding of disease simply does not exist. Medical treatment has remained virtually unchanged for centuries. Tonics, laxatives, and emetics are administered, some containing outright poisons. Welcome to Vienna General Hospital. Your five years of study here will lead to a prestigious medical degree. By the middle of the 19th century, Vienna General Hospital has become the world's foremost research and teaching institution. Primarily because the hospital provides physicians with an almost endless supply of cadavers for study and research. Into this primitive and unscientific world comes a young and inexperienced Hungarian physician Ignaz Semmelweis. Oh, my beloved Ignaz, a physician at last. Oh, it would not be good for me to be late on my first day. 